Welcome to another edition of My Arlington TV News. I'm Jeremy Thomas. Due to the rise of COVID-19 cases, the Federal Emergency Management Agency has opened a temporary drive through COVID-19 test site near Choctaw Stadium. The site, located in the Texas Rangers Siena Lot M, operates seven days a week from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. through February 8th. Those who want to come here and get tested to register in advance and by registering in advance, you'll be able to uh, select a time slot to come here and you're pretty much guaranteed that you're going to get tested. You must enter the lot southbound on AT&T Way. You are asked to pre-register at the link on your screen. Testing is free and open to all ages. Results will be available between 24 to 36 hours. The Arlington City Council is set to host five town hall meetings about residential trash collection. Across the country, there's a shortage of workers who collect trash by hand, then place it into trash trucks. Many companies are relying on automated trucks with a mechanical arm to pick up and empty trash carts. While Arlington already uses automated trucks for recycling services, the City Council is considering all options to be cost effective and have a reliable service. You can see a full list of the upcoming meetings in your district on your screen. And you can help shape the city's South State Highway 360 corridor by voicing your opinion. There is a virtual public meeting set for 6.30 p.m. January 24th. This public input period will unveil the complete draft strategy document for public review and feedback. A link to the meeting and the draft strategy document will be posted on the project's website. The public input period lasts until January 28th. Get your local news delivered straight to your inbox once a week from the City of Arlington. Sign up today for our weekly e-news email at arlingtontx.gov forward slash e-news. That's all for now. Have a great weekend, everyone.